So right now we have the Vancouver Pro going on and we do have a couple uh, photos coming through. Um, you know, not the best of quality, but quite a uh, interesting look at a couple of the competitors. And I do want to give a shout out to uh, Solius, is it? I believe. Uh, I'm going to leave his link to his Instagram in the description. Uh, he's the one that I'm getting all the material from. So I definitely want to make sure that I'm crediting the person that uh, I am referen referencing these photos from. Obviously, he did, probably didn't take the photos, but... Or maybe he did. I think he's actually at the show. So he probably uh, did take these photos himself. But, you know, shout out to him. Now, we do have a couple photos of all the competitors. But boy, oh boy. I saw a photo of Hadi. Hadi Chupan. Uh, where, where's he at? Yo, he's looking insane. He is looking on point now. The quality of these photos, as you can see, uh, well, this particular photo is not the best. But, guys, appreciate this man's conditioning. Uh, he has striations everywhere. You know, feathers in the quads, chest, you know, cross striations in the chest. Uh, everything is dialed. And everything is on point. Everything is looking insane. And this guy is originally a 212 bodybuilder because he weighs around that 212 range. But he's competing in the open. Yeah, that is pretty interesting. So, we you know, we already have the top, uh, the first call out. And uh, there is actually video footage of the first call out as well. If I can go ahead and I think this, no, nah, this isn't the first call out. Uh, first group of comparison. So the first group and the first call out are two different things. You know, they typically bring all the guys out, you know, in some kind of random order. And then they will generate the first call out. But uh, here is the first call out. Or the top four, sorry, sorry, the top four. Uh, so as you can see, we have Ian Valier, we have Hadi Chupan, we have uh, Nathan Diasha, and we have Lucas Osdo there. So this is going to be our top four guys. And, um, you know, as you can see, uh, Hadi is a bit dwarfed in height. Let me actually turn the volume down a little bit. Let me turn that down a little bit. But um, Hadi is dwarfed in height. But not necessarily in size. Uh, mm, well, to compare him to Nathan right now. Yeah, Nathan's width is insane right now. But uh, Hottie's bringing very good conditioning. This photo, this video right here, it's not the best in terms of being able to see how these guys actually look. But, you know, you can appreciate Hottie's V-taper. Uh, you can appreciate his arms, man. The size, bro. Like, geez louise. Like, honestly, dead ass, I think Hardy might crack top two in this show. Uh, I, I don't want to say he's going to win. I don't want to be that ballsy because we do have Nathan in the show. And Nathan, this man is looking really good now. I think he's a bit... I don't want to use the word off. But um, in comparison to his other shows, I've seen him in better conditioning. And... In comparison to Hardy, Hardy is definitely way more conditioned. Uh, you can definitely tell with the you know separation that Hardy has in his quads, like qua like feathers in the quads are insane. It really is. Uh, even some comments here, like what, do you, what does this guy say? Um, big, big chill man. Uh, he doesn't look good at all. Uh, was way better last year. Uh, he he looks good. I, I like I wouldn't say he doesn't look good at all. He definitely looks you know on point. I would say. But, bro, I mean, Hardy, bro. Like, when you're going to stand next to this, it, oh, my God. You know, it, it's just kind of like, bro, the detail. The detail, bro. So, I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen, but we do have the top four. Uh, so, if I were to look at this show and judge it myself, which I'm not a judge. I'm not trying to claim that I know what I'm talking about. But if I were to look at this show and, you know, kind of call the top four, I'm going to go uh, Lucas Osdo, number four. Ian Valier, I really like Ian Valier, I really do. But, I mean, bro, you have Nathan, you have Hardy. Like, those are insane bodybuilders. I'm going to have to put Ian in third. Uh, not because he's bad, but these guys are just literally insane. Ian in third. Hardy in... Do, do I want to put Hardy second? I, bro, the, the things that... The, the conditioning, like... Nathan is out-muscling him. He is. But Hardy is really conditioned. But I don't know. I really don't know. I really don't know what to say. I'm, I'm kind of stumped, to be honest. I want to put Hardy second and say Nathan first because I feel that's the safer bet. But Hardy is looking really insane. Like, on everything, bro. He's looking insane. Um, 
I kind of want to put Hottie first. <laughs> I kind of want to do that. <laughs> uh, don't crucify me, but geez Louise, man. He's he's looking really good. Uh, but I think Hottie will take second and Nathan will take the show. That That's what I think. Uh, I would love Hardy to win because he does look insane. And he's definitely worked his ass off to bring in this level of conditioning. Like, bro, that conditioning is insane. Uh, I think this is a walkout. Uh, just walk it out. Walk it. I think this might be a walkout here of just, uh, oh, Hardy by himself. Okay. Wait, free posing? All right, let's check it out. So, not the best video quality. You really can't see the great, great detail that we did see in the other photo. Uh, but, I mean, you can appreciate the structure. Can definitely appreciate uh, a good amount of conditioning, definitely, but just not everything. Obviously, it's not the best quality video, so you know, really, really can't really go off of this too much. But I mean, he, bro, he's on. Like, bro, my, my boy is on. Yo, bro, oh my god. So even though the quality is this bad, this man still has very clear detail in the uh, glutes. He has very clear. Ah, feathers and striations in the glutes, bro. Like, even with such bad video quality, like, goddamn, bro. This is an interesting show. Really interesting. Uh, I don't know who's going to win, but if I was a betting man, I would bet Hardy. I, I probably would. And I'm not sure if that would be an upset. Uh, he's literally beating Nathan, which is a top 10 Olympian. That is, that is something. That is something, bro, but... Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the quick update of the Vancouver Pro. I might be posting the results as well, so definitely stay tuned. Uh, yeah, Hardy is it, Hardy's condition is insane. Yep, it's insane. Uh, anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. Like, share, comment down below. If you're not subscribed, make it a thing. Sub to the boy, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.